Hello everyone. I am here with two more lace and linen bundles. Um, I have, I'm going to call this the pink one and this is going to be the teal one. How about that? <laughs> I don't know what to call them because it's not really like it's all pink or all teal, but I'm just going to go by these right here or these journals. I'm going to go by pink and this will be the teal one. So if you're interested, that's what they'll be called. So I can keep that straight. Okay. These are just little journals that I had made up. This is the cover on this one. They are, um, oh, I'm redoing my room so I lost everything. They are six by, let's just say four and a quarter. And they are slightly decorated. They come with some washi, some tags, envelopes. And um, I'll just flip through really quick. I do have a video, I think, on these. A little tablet. I'm not sure if I do or not. I'd have to go look. But they're just lightly decorated and made with a little this and a little that that I had laying around. Um little tags and extra tablet of paper, some little um, post-it notes stuck on there, a little flip, some coffee dyed, some not, and yeah, they're just, this has got fabric on the inside, I think I already showed you this, but yeah, they're just cute little pocket journals. I just jaunt down little things in these like little idea. I'm like, I'll call them idea pro idea journals. <laughs> Put your little ideas in there. And then this pink one is basically the layout is the same. Just got a little different pages, papers and things inside, different tags, but it's basically the same layout. And it also has fabric on the inside. I think the fabric, I really like having fabric on the insides because it keeps the spine and everything more sturdy. That's the way I think anyways. So this one will be the pink pile and this is going to be the teal pile. And I'll just do what I did last time. You get a big piece of this beautiful, it's I don't know what this is called, but I always take this apart and use the fabric and then I use the lace separately, but I didn't sit here and take it apart for y'all in case you don't want it to be apart, but you get a piece of that and then you get a yard of this pretty navy colored trim and a yard of this blue trim and it's Really, it's stretchy. It's good for closures and all sorts of things. And I better move this out over here because I'll be picking up stuff that don't go with it. And you get a big chunk of this is one of my favorites. It's got these tiny little flowers. This is old fabric. I don't know. It's just cotton, but it's it's an old fabric. This one has a little stain right there. I'm sure if you washed it or just cut around if you don't want to use that piece, but it's so old. I didn't wash it and I have like yards of it. So I don't really do anything with it until I go to use it, but it doesn't smell or anything. It has like strings coming off it, but yeah, each one of them, you get a piece of this amazing little tiny flower. I love these tiny flowers. And then it comes with, a, this is really thick like canvas. I can't remember what you call this kind of stuff, but I love this. Trina just made a journal out of this and you guys are going to see it soon and it's amazing. But you can use these for covers and everything. Each one has the same exact size. It was just a piece I had cut off in there. And then you get this pretty piece of linen. This was a curtain at one time. 
and I just been chopping and chopping on it because I love it so much. The reason why I'm showing you because somewhere in here stuff is a little different. That's why I do it this way. And then we have this amazing piece of upholstery fabric is what it is. It's really good for covers and layering. Oops. I am knocking stuff over. There's a yard, I think there's a little over a yard of this pretty lace here. Put that on there. A yard of this burlap ribbon. I love this. And um, I don't know, it's like a oopsie, half yard of this beautiful diamond. I don't know, trim, I guess you call this. Blingy, really pretty blingy trim. I love this. this. I got this from my going out of business store. Actually, I got um, the last few items that I showed you came from that store. And this is a pretty piece of, of a curtain that I have two of that I just cut this one in half so you can and just shared it between the two and this is amazing because you can cut these flowers out you can use it for layering I, I just like it use it for pockets in your journals and then this is a piece of a wedding dress top that um, I cut up and I've used lots of pieces of this dress in my journaling time and each one comes with half of the dress half of the top and then this piece this one I tried to avocado dye but it didn't really do anything but make it a little bit not so white <laughs> and that one goes over there and this is just a piece of cotton doily that I had laying about that I used and I think I don't know why that's in this one because I don't know but anyways <laughs> it is and then there's this piece of cotton doily and each one you get a piece of this green doily and each one I love the I love this oh my goodness I forgot I had that so I'm gonna start using some of that in mine as well this piece of trim that I well, it was a doily, but I've chopped it up so much, but I just left this intact so you can use this in many different ways. And we have, come on, these little cotton doilies that you can cut up. I even use these for innards of um, flowers. And there's a yard of this trim really pretty trim I love that I think there might even be more in a yard yeah there's like a yard there's almost almost two yards of that actually in each one and then this one has this little guy doily there's a little tiny stain right there but I like I said I didn't wash these some I've gotten from garage sales some I've gotten happy mail and then this one has this owl looking one I think it looks like an owl it has a hole in it but I tried to pull the strings out but I didn't want it to fall apart I'll let whoever gets this one cut it up but it's amazing and then I don't know why that's there there's this piece that has been cut up on. These are amazing, like I said, for layering pieces. And then we have this little linen napkin and this one. And then there's this piece of linen, which I love. You know what I love using these for? Because I've already obviously cut on this one. I um, stamp on this and cut them out. And then I use this as, you know, like bottom of pockets or whatever. But, um, yeah, I love stamping on this linen fabric. I really like the way it looks. 
It's like I just got done um, stamping a bunch of, this one isn't on that fabric, but like just stamping numbers and letters and things on it. And here are two little doilies, cotton doilies of a different color. Lincoln, no. <sighs> My dog. This is a piece of a doily here. So cute. And so this one goes over here. This is uh, this doily that I have here. Lincoln, no. Stop it. And this one has this one. And they come with a couple pieces of this trim that I've cut off. It's cotton trim. It's white. And then we have these little stars. Why am I picking them out of this one and putting them over here? No. Yeah, okay. There's stars and then there's this little white one and another one of these. These are like a cream brownish color. And these ones right here come in between these when they're all hooked together. So cute. We have one, two, three. This one has a pink spot on it because it's been stored for so long. So three of these. And each one. Two pink ones in each one. two of these little guys in each one all cotton on each of these which I love these and I don't think I even have any more of these I'm not sure um, three of these guys and a piece big piece of this like was in the other kits as well and it's I just love this I don't know what it is about it but I love making bows out of it layering all sorts of stuff like that with this and we got these are what you put over um, teacups like when you're outside so bugs don't get in your in your glass I got these at a garage sale, and that lady told me that. I thought, oh, that's so cool. But each one gets that. Um, I think they got, yeah, two of these flowers. Big, large cotton flowers. And this was left over off of a curtain that I took apart and you can um, take your seam, seam ripper and get this cotton off and you can stamp on this cotton so don't throw it away because you can stamp your little sayings on here I don't know if I, this one like I said isn't oh I just got done doing some all these but they're on um, canvas but I also use the backs of these I don't have one right here handy or I would show you this one is on fabric that's came off the back of a curtain but yeah I just stamp on that stuff I don't throw it away but there's like a little over half a yard and I love this stuff too you can cut that off that's a half a flower right there love it love it love it and it's white white then there's a big piece of this fabric and it's got sparkly in it I don't know if you can see the sparkles but it's really pretty I love this I love all this stuff though I really really do it's hard for me to part with this some of the stuff um this is some pretty pretty um lacy curtain type fabric really pretty and this one comes with 
this piece of wedding dress applique part. I think this was part of the top of the dress. I'm not quite, I can't quite remember. I think it was a part of the, the wedding, the top of it. But it's so pretty. And this one, I didn't have two pieces of those right offhand, so this one gets this one. And this one to replace for this one over here. And this one has this pretty trim. And this one has oh, this pretty trim. Really pretty. And you get some blue. I just love this blue. I only have one little piece of this, I think, left after this. They each have a piece of this cotton. I love these. You can cut these up. They're so cute. This one looks like this. It came from the same um, fabric, just different pieces. Um, this is white piece of a curtain, which I love. And this one is cream. This one's a little longer. Just a different curtain, but basically the same. Just a longer piece. And you get to one of these napkins. I love this color. It's like a taupe color. I have a couple more of those saved for myself. And here's another pretty piece of lace, lacy fabric. Um, and this is again that other wedding dress that I've cut up that has the embossed, pretty embossed side. This is the outside, but you could really use both sides comes with two two pieces two bigger pieces of that and this one I think is just one big piece so I didn't cut it it wasn't cut um, oh no I didn't put a piece in both of this oh well we're gonna share it so we're gonna go like this so they both have a piece of this because it's really pretty. I love these. So they both get a piece of that. Um, no string, please. This is Hobby Lobby tr trim and it's stretchy, but it's so pretty. And this one gets this doily. And this one gets the white and yellow doily. This one has a little bit of, I don't know if that's a hole or what, but I cut them up anyway, so. <laughs> you get like a yard of this pretty silky, I think it's layered, no? See-through type fabric, which would make cute, like, oh my goodness, there's just endless things that you can do with all of this stuff. They both get two yellow, orangish doilies. This chunk of doily is so cute. Oh, there goes my phone. They're gonna have to wait a minute. This one comes with this hanky. This one comes with this hanky. Um, this has peach. This is a pretty peach color. It doesn't, it shows better if I sit it down here, but it's really a pretty, pretty peach color. The camera doesn't do it justice at all. And this one is purple. So pretty. So pretty. They each come with a piece of this blingy bling off of a wedding dress. And 
a big piece of this, which you can cut each apart. I have some of these cut out as stars, and then some of them I do as flowers, like this whole piece would be a flower. Each one gets that, and each one gets a big piece of this pinwheel blanket that I got at a garage sale. So yeah, those are my next two kits that are available. They are $49 each, come with free shipping. And yeah, I will link my Facebook below. And if you are interested, just send me a PM and I will get them right out to you um, next week because can't ship tomorrow so yeah so remember this is the pink side and this is the teal side so have a great day thank you so much for watching and i will see y'all soon bye bye